Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Here you can see, I have already imported the files required for this project. You can download them from below link in the description. Now let's start with creating the Instagram story, create a new composition, name it as glossy text. For this composition, change width to, 1080, and height to, 1920. Time duration to 5 seconds. Perfect. Now let's add the text. For this tutorial, I will be using Edwardian font family. Increase the font size. Now position the text to center. You can reduce the space between the text. Perfect. Let's recompose the text layer. I will name it as text composition. Perfect. Now let's create a new solid. Name it as noise. For this noise layer, in effects and preset. Search for fractal noise. Add it to the solid layer. Now for fractal noise, change fractal type to. Dynamic twist. Select inverted. Change contrast to 150. In transform, change scale to 150. Change complexity to 18. Now in subsetting, change subscaling to 85. Now let's add expression for evolution. While pressing Alt key, click on stopwatch of evolution. Enter expression. Time, 50. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's recompose it. I will name it as noise. Select move all attributes into the new composition. Now hide the noise composition, for text composition, in effects and preset, search for CC image, wipe. Add it to the text composition. At start of the timer line, for image, wipe, create keyframe for completion. Change it to, 100%. Now go at 2 seconds. Change completion to, 0%. Change border softness to, 5%. In gradient. Change layer to, noise. You can see the preview. Now let's create a new adjustment layer. For this adjustment layer, in effects and preset, search for turbulent displace. Add it to the adjustment layer. Now at 2 seconds. Create keyframe for amount. At start of the timer line, change amount to 0%. Now at 4 seconds, change amount to 0%. Now press U to view created keyframes, select keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. For this turbulent displace, change size to 20. Perfect. 
Now select all the three layers, pre-compose them. Name it as noise text. Now from project panel, add the glass reflection image to the timer line, place it below noise. For this reflection image, in effects and preset, search for CC Repertile. Add it to reflection image. Now expand the right, left, up, and down value, till it fills the screen. Change tiling to unfold. Perfect. Now in effects and preset, search for offset. Add offset to reflection layer. At start of the timer line, create keyframe for shift center. Now at end of the timer line, change center position as shown. You can see the preview. For reflection, in effects and preset, search for tint, add it to the reflection layer. Set tint amount to 40%. Now in effects and preset, search for curves, add it to the reflection image. Slightly adjust the curves as shown. Now in effects and preset, search for fast box blur, add it to the reflection image. Change blur radius to 6. Iteration to 1. Perfect. Now let's pre-compose the reflection image. I will name it as Reflection Map. For Reflection Map, change Track Map to Alpha Map Noise Text. You can see the preview. For Reflection Map, in Effects and Preset, search for CC Blob Lies. Add it to the Reflection Composition. For Bloiness, change Blob Layer to Noise Text. Property to Alpha. Change Softness to 9. Change Cutaway to 5. In Light, change Light Type to Point Light. You can adjust the position. For Reflection Map. Now in Effects and Preset, search for Curves. Add curves to reflection composition. Now here you need to adjust the curves as shown, to get a perfect golden color for the text. You can see the preview. Perfect. Our glossy text reveal is ready. Now let's create another composition. Name it as Story. Now let's create a new solid layer. Name it as Background. In Effects and Preset, search Gradient Tramp. Add it to the solid layer. Set start and end color, as shown. Change ramp style to, radial ramp. Here if you want, you can adjust the start and end position of the ramp. Set ramp scatter value to, 500. Now from project panel, add the bokeh image to the timeline. Position it. For bokeh image, in effects and preset, search for block dissolve. Add it to the light layer. Change transition completion to, 50%. Change block width to, 20. Change block height to, 20. Change feather to, 350. For light, change mode to, add. Now from project panel, add the glossy text to the timeline. Now create duplicate of this glossy text composition. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicate. 
Now add the glitter particle media file to the timeline. For glossy text, change track matte to alpha matte glitter particle. For glossy text, in effects and preset, search for minimax, add it to the glossy text composition. For minimax, change radius to, 20. Change channel to, alpha and color. Perfect. Now from project panel, add the heart formation media file to the timeline. For heart formation, change mode to screen. Slightly adjust the position of this media file on the timeline. You can see the preview. Add particles media file to the timeline. Change mode to add for particle media file change rotation to 90 degrees now add the short lens media file to the timeline for this media file change mode to add here you are free to place this media file wherever you want You can also create multiple duplicates of this media file, and position them according to the text. Perfect. Now let's change all the layers to 3D, except for the background layer. Now let's create a new camera layer. Now create a new null object. Change null to 3D. Parent camera to null object. For null, Press P to bring up position, at start of the timeline, create keyframe for position. Now go at end of the timeline. Increase the position value for Z axis as shown. Perfect. Now let's create a new adjustment layer. For adjustment layer, in effects and preset, search for vibrance. Add it to the adjustment layer. Change vibrance to, 10. Change saturation to, 10. In effects and preset, search for curves. Add it to the adjustment layer. Slightly adjust the curves as shown. Now create a new adjustment layer. In effects and preset, search for camera lens blur. Add it to the adjustment layer. At 4 seconds. Change blur radius to, 0. Create a keyframe for blur radius. Now at end of the timeline, change blur radius to, 50. Select repeat edge pixel. Now let's create a new solid layer. Name it as color, for this solid layer, you can set the color here or you can add fill effect and set color to black. Press T to bring up the opacity, at end of the timeline, create keyframe for opacity, at 4 seconds. Change the opacity to, 0%. Perfect. Now let's see the complete preview. Here our Instagram story is created. Similarly, you can create multiple story compositions and create your Valentine's wish story for your loved ones. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial, see you next week with another awesome tutorial.